Arthur Nzeribe, the Oguta born maverick and second republic politician, was a man of different shades. Some remember him as the one used by the military to truncate Nigerians' transition to democracy through the annulment of June 12, 1993 presidential election. Arthur Nzerebe was a man whose image had several interpretations. His perceived stubbornness and great business acumen stood him out. Nzerebe was born on November 2, 1938, to an influential family in Oguta, Imo State. In 1969, Nzerebe met Kwame Nkrumah and became his public relations officer, which led to a spell in Ghana. He grew in riches and influence while in Ghana. Despite the coup that ousted Nkrumah on February 24, 1966, and a series of scandals that involved Nzerebe, his influence did not diminish among the Ghanaian elite. Nzerebe established himself as a prolific businessman across the globe. He later entered Nigerian's political scene and became a senator in 1983. Leading up to the June 12 presidential election in 1993, Nzerebe played a significant role by demanding that the military regime remain in power. He created the Association for Better Nigeria, a group of private citizens, sponsoring a campaign calling for Ibrahim Babangida, the then military head of state, to remain in office for at least another four years. Then, he claimed the organization had garnered petitions from more than 25 million Nigerians who supported the cause. On 15 June, as the collation of the votes was ongoing, the organization obtained a court injunction to hold the counting and verification of election results. This time, the National Electoral Commission accepted the injunction and announced on 16 June that it was suspending announcements of the results, citing the court order. Then, eight days later, Papangida announced the annulment of the election. Many believed that Nzerebe had personal ties with the junta and was used to derail the election, but Nzerebe consistently denied it. After Nigeria's return to democracy in 1999, Nzerebe contested for Olu senatorial seat and won. Three years later, he was suspended indefinitely by Aigin Pius Aigin, the then president of the Senate, over his alleged involvement in a 22 million naira fraud. Nzerebe will be exiled from the legislature for nine months until his re-election in 2003. He lost his senatorial seat in 2006 and since then his political career began to decline.